this whole wheat bread is super soft light and fluffy and it's packed with loads of nutrients and fibers and it smells amazing and it tastes delicious it's so easy to make this bread and we use only six basic ingredients to make this wheat bread and in this video we'll see how to make this healthy whole wheat bread in five simple steps So as the first step, let's prepare our bread dough. Into a bowl, add in some lukewarm water, water which is not cold nor hot, but just slightly warm. Add in the honey, salt, yeast, and stir until all our ingredients get dissolved in water. Then add in the butter. Here I've used a soft butter which makes it easy for us to blend them together. And now add in the whole wheat flour and combine them all together to form a shaggy mass of dough. Now transfer this dough onto a clean work surface and we need to knead the dough. And in the beginning of kneading we may feel the dough is very sticky and we may get tempted to add more flour into this but don't do that just continue to knead and you can see slowly the extra moisture will get absorbed into the flour and our dough will change its texture it will get more soft smooth and elastic And now after kneading for 10 to 12 minutes, our dough is almost ready. Let's test and see if our dough is done. So apply some water and then stretch the dough. And we are now able to stretch the dough into a thin membrane without tearing. So we got a good gluten strength and it means that our dough has enough strength to stretch and puff and accommodate all those gas produced during fermentation. So now our dough is ready for the first proofing. So lightly oil a clean bowl and place the dough inside it and cut it with some oil and then wrap it with a plastic film and let the dough sit and rise for one to one and a half hours or until it gets doubled in size. Now after 75 minutes of proofing, our dough has risen well. And so de-gas the dough. And just press and form it into a rectangle. Here I've already greased my pan with some butter. And now we need to roll it and form it into a log. The length of that log should be approximate length of our pan. And place it onto the greased baking pan. I'm 
also greasing this plastic film with some oil to prevent any chance of dough sticking to the cling film. So wrap the pan loosely with the plastic film and let the dough sit and rise for next 45 minutes. And now after 45 minutes, our dough has risen well and it's ready to go into the oven. So place it into a 350 degree Fahrenheit preheated oven for 32 to 36 minutes. And after baking, we'll get a beautiful loaf of whole wheat bread. The smell of this freshly baked whole wheat bread is so amazing. And now let's demold the bread. The top of bread may seem a bit hard. It will soften as it cools down. Or if you want to get a more softer crust, just apply some butter on top of the bread. And now we need to let the bread cool down completely. And this cooling down process is still the part of cooking process as the steam which is entrapped within the bread will help the bread to cook completely. And you can see our bread is so soft, light and fluffy and it tastes super delicious. And it's so good that we can make a super light and airy bread with 100% whole wheat flour. And before making this whole wheat bread, I would suggest you to read the blog post, which I hope will be helpful for you. I've given the link to the blog post in the description box below and in the iCard above. And I hope you like this recipe and I hope you will make this healthy whole wheat bread at home. And I hope everybody will love it. And if you like this video, please give your valuable thumbs up and please don't forget to share this recipe with your friends and family who love making bread at home. And thank you so much for your love and support and thanks for watching this video. See you next time.